We shall remain standing as we go to the Lord in prayer. You have come to the solution ground of this third day of the supernatural liberation through Christ global crusade. It is your season of total emancipation, your season of triumphant elevation and timely empowerment. Amen. In Matthew chapter 15, verse 13, Jesus said that every plant which my father has not planted shall be rooted up. We are going to pray that God will root out and destroy the powers behind all forms of killings, all forms of kidnappings, all forms of banditry in Africa and in other parts of the world. Lift up your voice and pray. Every form of banditry, every form of kidnapping, every form of killing and unnecessary murders that is happening, God will wipe it out. The powers behind those operations, God will destroy it. In Jesus' name we pray. In John chapter 2, Jesus made a scourge and overthrew the temples of the money changers who have turned the temple of God into something else. We are going to pray that God will overthrow, God will overturn all the negative agenda of the devil globally among all demography. Begin to pray that God will completely overturn and overthrow every negative agenda of Satan among the young, among the old, among the blacks, among the whites, everywhere globally. God will overthrow and overturn all the agenda of Satan. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Can I hear another amen? We're going to pray for our Father in the Lord. We're going to lift up our voices and pray for him that as this global crusade is going on, God will give him option to function. Begin to pray that God will grant him option to function in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. We're still going to pray for him that God will give him more anointing for accomplishment and empowerment for expansion of the church. Begin to pray that God will give our general superintendent more anointing for accomplishment and more empowerment for expansion of the church in this end time. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. In Matthew chapter 16, verse 18, Jesus said, I will build my church, and the gates of hell shall not prevail against the church. We are going to pray that at this time and time, God will strengthen all other gospel ministers and all churches globally for the end time harvest. That Jesus will build his church and the gates of hell, the powers of hell, will not prevail against the church. Pray. Lift up your voice and lift gospel ministers up. Lift up your voice and lift all churches up. Churches that are doing something in the kingdom. And God will empower them for the expansion of the kingdom, for the exhortation of the king. God will strengthen the church for the end time harvest. In Jesus' name, we pray. We're going to pray that tonight there will be supernatural liberation, emancipation, and deliverance for every captive. Souls will be saved. The sick will be healed. The bound, those who are bound, they will be delivered. 
Raise up your voice and pray and tell the Lord that tonight His power will come down in a mighty way. The souls will be saved, sinners will be saved, people who are bound, they will be loosed, people who are oppressed, they will be set free. That tonight will be a night indeed of supernatural liberation in Jesus' name. Can I hear another amen? Yeah. Heavenly Father, in the name of Jesus, we thank you tonight. We thank you because we have come tonight. I will pray that every power behind all the bloody killings, kidnappings, and banditry in Africa and beyond, we pray that you will root out and destroy those powers in Jesus' name. Amen. And we are praying, oh Lord, that every plant you have not planted, oh Lord, they will be rooted out. All the plantations of Satan, everywhere there is the negative agenda of Satan, let them be rooted out in Jesus' name. Amen. And we pray, Lord, tonight for our general superintendent, the great apostle of our time. We we'll pray for empowerment. We we'll pray for anointing. We we'll pray for unction. That souls will be saved. The sick will be healed. The bound, they will be delivered. And Lord, your name will be glorified. Thank you, Lord, because we will answer. We we'll pray that all the other gospel ministers, those who are represented here tonight, and those who are not, who are all over the world, strengthen your church, strengthen your ministers. For the end time global harvest, in Jesus' name, Amen. in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Can I hear another big amen? amen? Can I hear a hell-shaking amen? amen? Give me a final, Satan-humiliating amen.